Hey everyone, welcome back to episode two of of Ash and Dust. That's gonna sound a little bit weird saying it like that. I made it back almost to where we were. Um, I know I died since then, so kind of no point really. Oh no, no, I didn't. Fuck. That's the thing about skipping a day. You hella forget things. Um. Hey, gold pine. Nice. Okay, so this is where they moved it. Anyways, uh, in today's episode, we are gonna probably try not to get crushed by the Balder Knight. No, this is the Berenique Knight, right? Ouch. And be a parry god. Continue to be a parry god. Yeah, this guy's gonna be more difficult because we are weaker. Not by much, though, when you think about it. Oh. Sh shit. Shit. Maybe I shouldn't take on this guy just yet. Um. Man, I've died a lot. I know I've said this before in the previous episode as well. But I've died a lot. Let's see how easy running back is. Might not actually be that difficult. That's the case. I think this is the option we're gonna be. We're gonna be running with. God, that's the only thing that sucks about using the rapier type weapons. It's not having the kick. Nice. I like it. And the final thing I forgot to mention on the way back, I did get a Titanite Shard drop. I actually have quite a few Titanite Shards. I'm gonna be stubborn and I'll try to kill this guy again. I hate, hate letting things like this go. Of course the issue with this dude is that you can't even backstab him. It's just the type of enemy he... Oh, fuck, I'm so stupid. Why didn't I pyromancy him? That's more like it. He has a chance to heal as well, so you gotta be careful. Loaded up on shards. So anyways, now that we've like... Lucerne, interesting. Now that we've like chilled the situation out a little bit. Yeah, we're gonna be just continuing in this game. Probably seeing the first... Like actual boss. Although again, as far as I know... But don't like, quote me on this for sure. As far as I know, the bosses are relatively untouched. Okay. Maybe me playing Dark Souls 2 at the same time as this game is not the best idea. I, I mean it half as a joke, but you know, like... Oh, hello. Okay. This is different. I mean it in the sense that the parrying is insanely different. I knew it. You know, Dark Souls 2 being very... Like, damn. Okay, that dealt a lot of damage. Being all about them reaction parries. And this game, not even reaction, like prediction parries. And this game being more reaction based. What I'm trying to say is I'm making an excuse. A pre-excuse for all my fucked up parries. That's nice. What the hell? The second dude is there. Interesting. Uh, 
What? No! Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Alright, that was the stupidest thing I've ever done. That's how that's how scared I got. Is I I I leapt off the edge of the wall. That's how scary that enemy was casting emit force. Well, that was one of the dumbest things I've ever done. You know, people who watch my streams, and if you don't watch my streams, you you've got to be fucking with me. You have got to be double fucking with me. Seriously, I stood up and fell. Okay, this really is becoming a meme. A bad meme too, if I should say so myself. That... Gravity is my worst enemy. It's awful. Like, gravity really fucks with me. In Souls games. And... I don't know what I've done to deserve this treatment. I knew it was possible. I knew it was possible to... Why couldn't I have done that the first time around? Because honestly, I'm more pissed about the two... Uh, humanities that I lost. Than the souls. Like, it was 2,400 souls. That's nothing. That's jack shit. But I'm pissed about the two humes. Not that it's like an end-of-the-world type scenario, but... Still, fuck. So this is really interesting. Oh fuck. Are you kidding me? Are they aggroed on each other? They're not. They are. That's pretty funny. Is he dead? No he's not. But he's not aggroed on the... Interesting. So... The Taurus Demon can hit the dude. The dude doesn't hit the Taurus Demon. Oh no, yes he does. There's some like weird interactions here. Can we become friends if we like? Maybe we just got off on the wrong foot, you know. That guy has a lot of HP. Can we? Can we become buddies now? We did just get off on the wrong foot. Bruh. You're trying to kill me before. I got a bunch of shit. Okay, that's really interesting. That was... Unexpected, to say the least. Lower on that. Oh, shit, we already got the lower on that berg. I'm gonna have to check while editing what I got that was really funny cuz like weird weird it's all good we became friends in the end and of course the bra solaris here okay the dialogue is familiar to us. Might as well see what's up with the summons. Whether um, summons stay the same or are kind of remixed. Dragon works the same way. I'm 
still gonna go ahead and unlock the shortcut. Mainly because we also... I kinda had a feeling. As I was coming down the stairs, I was just about to say, there is definitely enemies here. Lacerate? Okay. Hold on just a second. Did we have lacerating arrows in this game? So I remember that's like a Dark Souls 2 thing, right? I think that's what I'm gonna do. I think lacerating arrows are the ones that do bleed, right? I'm like 90% sure that's the Dark Souls 2 thing. That's cool though. Okay, so if I, we have a choice... I think I'd prefer to go to the chapel first before Lower Undead. I do like that they give you the option to go to Lower Undead Burg. Come on. Come on, dragon. Imagine if this is the one thing they change. Nah. You can change AI behavior. At least I don't think you can. You can speed it up or slow it down as we found out. Found out unfortunately. That was a very strange interaction. Did you see like the fire was still active but I also kind of respawned the enemies. You can just you can just enter. Or is this... I don't know. I want to be a Sombro. They just let you join. Yeah, this is not how it works. You need some faith to join. That's cool. Not that I'm ever going to use that spell. The concept of being a Sombro is enough for me. Plenty enough. So are Black Knight just replaced with Berenique Knights? To me it kind of looks like it. Which is interesting. Ouch. I was banking on that parry. Come on, try healing. Apparently, yeah. Nice, blue tear stone. I don't think we have even any rings. Man, I should have put on the ring of sacrifice. You know, not looking back at it. Those two humanities. Could have been mine. Oh, hello. That's what I like to see. It appears to be a basic prison cell key. That's what, again, that's what we like to see. A bit of mystery in the game. That's all we want. Of course, have three of them. Oh shit. God, why do you take four hits? Five hits even. Yeah, this is why I wanted to come here first before Undead Berg, because... Oh shit. I'm like getting drive drive by it here. Drive by it? That doesn't make any sense. What's the past tense of having a drive by performed on you? I guess it's a drove by. You know what? Each I was gonna say eat shit, but I fell off. And I was gonna say I'm about to die. 
shit. The enemies don't deal more damage though, do they? I don't know. Maybe they do. Maybe they do because the boy is having um, functionally a rough, a rough time. A rougher time than he usually does with this stage of souls. Which means I'm either just playing shit like today. And I played like shit yesterday. Oh, hello, pig. I didn't know you can enter here. At least what I can do is attempt to demonstrate what I was trying to do previously. Oh, come on. Get on my level. At least that hit. Which almost got me killed. Bruh. I appreciate the mad titanite shards though. Weapon upgrades are not gonna be a problem. Oh by the way, thank you for the weapon suggestions on the previous episode. Guys actually had quite a few good ideas that I'm considering. I'll stick with the S-Talk for now. Seriously? But we'll see. Fuck off. Okay. Interesting that he's running the wrong way. This is the pig that you can backstab. So this shouldn't be that difficult. These guys are weak to fire, I think, too. Come on. Shit. Game. At least allow me to skewer this pig up the ass. Actually. Never mind. I didn't just say that. This might actually be... See, going back to my previous point, not to harp on it, but really to harp on it. If I'd managed to keep those two humanities, and those two humanities really were the key to everything, and I'm playing like a f fucker, like a true fucker, uh, I could have gotten 10 Estes, which would have made this much, much, much easier. How am I doing on time? Because probably hella wasted. I actually, we're not doing as bad as I thought. It is stupid risking fall damage with this much HP. I like to live dangerously. That's how we do it on the Mr. Sketchhead Entertainment channel, which is the official name of my shell company. An actual black knight. Not for right now. Let me tell you that. That is not for right now. That was very risky. What the hell am I doing? Okay, please just have like normal... I'm going for it. 
I don't really have a choice, do I? I think... And I don't say this often. I don't think people have said this often. I think the blue tear stone might have actually saved me. Unbelievably. Because I think I should have died. And I didn't. Due to it. That's very... Thank you, bull... Bull, bull tear stone. <laughs> Can't even speak. Blue tear stone. To the rescue. We're definitely kindling this bonfire. In terms of weapons, oh yeah, back to talking about weapons. People suggested the Partisan, which I'm kind of biased towards. You know how I feel about the Partisan. I like that weapon a lot. Cool. Let's just check. He sells the same things, as always. No, Blunt Bolt. Huh. Interesting. So they added like a bunch of... What you call it? Like new... Like weapon, not weapon types. Um, ammo types. I'm gonna, you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna get it to plus five. See, normally the partisan is in the forest there. But of course, I don't know whether that's the case. The other weapon I was thinking of is the server. It's kind of a unique weapon. God, I hate that. That stun lock. It stun locks so much. I swear to you that things are dealing more damage. Or maybe it's just the salt pouring out of every orifice. Maybe it's just the salt speaking. I am not going to deny the possibility of that. Okay, this is gonna like, take like three years to kill this thing. Why am I not using my pyromancies? I'm, I'm an idiot. Oh, come on! Fuck. Hmm. Maybe I just... Instead of get good, it's get bad. Maybe that's just what happened. My soul skills, which is amount. You've got to be shitting me. It's like Dark Souls 2 tracking. Maybe they are really representing Scholar of the First Sin. Okay, I'm gonna trust I'm gonna stop trying to kill this guy. Because it's like not working out at all. I'm like not dealing enough damage to him. Even with the plus five S stock. I'm sure he's not weak to piercing damage. Holy fuck. 
I'm almost a hundred percent on that. But maybe I'm just having an off day. I got a couple of minutes left anyways. So let's use the opportunity to talk to Onion Bro. I like this dude. I was absorbed in thought. I am Ziegmeier of Katarina. The OG. I run flat up against a wall or a gate, I should say. The thing just won't budge. No matter how long so weighing <laughs> Cool. We'll get that open for you, don't worry, bruh. And we're also gonna use our souls. Nice. Oh I like that. I really like that. It actually says how much it's worth. And man, why can't they just have implemented that? That is GG's mod makers. G fucking G's. Uh, I think that's such a simple but like obvious feature, you know. And that's what we're gonna go for. That I kind of can't believe it's never been done. Instead of having to always guess how much each of these souls are worth, people said to use the coin, but I can't. People said to use that coin near one of these coffins. Maybe it's something for later. Now that somebody said that, the only thing I can think of is that this must be like the fast travel mechanic, right? God. I swear enemies are dealing... Maybe I just have very low HP. Um, it's been ages since I actually played the Pyromancer class in this game. Heavy difficulty has been ramped up. Nice. I like the little worshippers. I can see that there's a like more attention paid to atmosphere, but in like the little details, not that you know. I'm not saying that the atmosphere building of Dark Souls One is like bad or anything. The opposite, but I just took the time to improve where possible. Like, I like this church this way. I think this is a good idea. Ouch. But then again, I'm like so on point with my parries. But then I get like overconfident. And probably that's the thing that gets me into trouble. Okay, you know what? That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna visit that area with the Black Knight. God, he draws that out, doesn't he? Try that again, bitch. I knew it. I fucking heard him coming. <sighs> you and your aggro range. The fucking ultra greatsword one too. 
Let's just go somewhere where you cannot knock me off. You cannot like blast me into a bottomless pit. You deal a lot of damage. Oh, the tracking. <sighs> Soul of a Scorched Knight. Hmm. In case there is a way to purify this tormented soul from pain and death. Okay. Can you rescue black knights in this game? Is that what's going on? That's what it sounds like. Oh, come on, just attack. Thank you. The difficulty, really, again. Of not having a weapon with a kick. It's kind of an oversight. There should be a way to break shields with these types of weapons as well. Still, as I go and look at what this treasure is. Claymore, nice. I'm going to take the opportunity to slowly start wrapping this episode up. Man, this mod is not easy, man. It's not easy. It could be, again, maybe I'm just having an off day. It could also be that I'm under-leveled. And it could be that this dynamic of Dark Souls 2 and Dark Souls 1, playing them at the same time, maybe that's fucking with me. But I don't know, man. This this seems difficult. Uh, but it's kind of what we're here for, ain't it? That's kind of the point. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Of Ash and Dust. I gotta come up with something, something different, of Dark Souls, Ash, of Ash and Dust, that sounds weird as well. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe as always, turn on post notifications if you enjoyed, yeah, I'll catch all of you next time, peace out and goodbye.